Many Long Islanders are called to traffic court to settle fines or negotiate dismissed tickets. But on hot summer days, beware. Don't arrive dressed for the weather. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan has this exclusive report on the no shorts policy in Nassau County. You cannot see the judge with shorts on. You Seriously? Have you have to oh. put pants over your oh. shorts? Yeah. Yeah, 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 I just, yeah, I just, yeah, I just yeah, kept yeah, only 90 yeah, degrees yeah, out here. Yeah, I'm from yeah. Amityville, New York, and I had to, they want me to go home and get a pair, a pair of pants. Viewers alerted us to Nassau County's Parking and Traffic Violations Agency policy. We, too, were surprised that in this setting, a former warehouse on Cooper Street in Hempstead, where drivers come to fight fines and seek reduced ticket fees, women and men must dress with decorum. I just said to him, if they want you to wear pants, you go to court or something, well, then they should put that on the ticket. It's not on the ticket. No mention of a dress code on his ticket. James Hawkins has to take another day off work. Traffic court's about to close. No time to change. They should probably list it, though, on your ticket when so you're So you didn't the arrive you know. with the tank top and the capri shorts. You can't wear shorts or apparel. To cool off, they won't even let you have water in there. It's very hot today. Too many rules? The traffic agency clearly posts etiquette requirements on both the agency door and its website, but these drivers say warnings should also be printed on each ticket. So, what did you do? I turned around, purchased the pair of pants. You purchased them? Yeah, uh, from them, along with this gentleman. Yeah. You too, sir? That's exactly what happened to me, too. So, I went around the corner and bought a pair of pants. Yeah, 50 bucks for a pair of pants, $80 for the ticket, and I had to waste all this time. Douglas Durbin showed us the pants receipt, $52. Cecil Thomas, too. They and others ran three blocks to Hempstead's business district, where clothiers seem happy with the court's no shorts policy. It's actually good for business. They're buying the pants. And the dress code is also supported by lawyers we spoke with. Can't go to court with shorts. It's not appropriate to tank cops. Next thing you know, we'll be having people with bathing suits. Nassau County's traffic court calls its policy fair and just. Citizens say just printed on the ticket. On Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News. Policy also includes no tank tops, flip flops, food, beverages, or phones.